The Breakers have bagged a significant win in the NBL off-season, securing the signature of a key member of this season's grand final campaign, Aussie guard Will McDowell-White, turning down other clubs to commit to a coach who's poured effort into him. Guy Havelt has more. This is the first time I've ever seen you with a button down shirt. Even when separated by the Tasman Sea, the bond between player and coach couldn't be more obvious. He's probably the one guy I trust the most. Um, he's the first guy who's really put that kind of effort into um, expanding my game for me. That dedication's paid off. Modi Maor getting the one signature he really wanted this off-season, with Will McDowell-White staying on at the Auckland club. The Aussie-born guard choosing the breakers over considerable interest and more money from home. A lot, a lot of mornings I woke up to a lot of text messages from a couple of teams. Um, sometimes, you know, 9, 10 text messages telling me what to do. I hope everybody's learned their lesson to not try and recruit players from the breakers because they're not leaving. So instead of uh, wasting your energy, go get other guys. McDowell White's fast become the league's hottest commodity to the extent some believe this is one of the biggest recommitments for a Kiwi team in a trans-Tasman competition. His third season with the breakers highlighting his growth. McDowell White continuing to do whatever he likes. Averaging 10.5 points, 6 assists and 5 rebounds a game and helping lead them to the grand final series this year. Now it's a matter of completing the roster, including the likelihood they'll be looking for new imports. Filling in now the other spots around him, knowing that we have him as a creator, uh, knowing what pairings he needs with him as a screener, as a roller, what's good to have around, etc. Um, it's a great place to start. Another potential signing this week, the Breakers putting the pieces together in a bid to go one better. Guy Havelt, One News.